Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. Welcome to my little corner of the internet. My name is Crypto Princess, and welcome to What Never Was. I don't know what this game is about, but the reviews on Steam were over subtitles, yes, were overwhelmingly uh, positive. And so I thought I would give it a try and see what it's actually about. Hey, Mom. Where are you? Oh my god, Mom. Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. God damn it, Mom. I know, but Mom, don't we owe it to Grandpa to... Yeah, I know. It's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Yeah, Mom, don't sell it. Okay. Okay, whatever. It's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then... I don't know. We can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah. Bye. I like the voice acting so far. Very, very, uh, natural. It doesn't sound forced. I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. Alright. Let's do this. That animation's good. Ooh, hello. I might need to lower the qual- wait, what? Yes, I'm aware. I might need to lower the visuals. Uh, yeah. Okay. My laptop cannot handle. Oh god. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. Hey. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. Are worth inspecting more than once. It's a magnifying glass. It's a magnifying glass. Oh, Grandma's cello. What? So this is where it's a banker's probably really old, but in great condition. It's a banker's lamp. Okay. A desk drawer. A desk drawer. What? How the fuck? It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. I did not know I could actually. Ah. The old gramophone. I used to put this on for Grandpa after dinner, and we'd sit and listen to it together. I didn't know you could... <sighs> it's going to take forever to sort through all these. Okay, shut up. Yeah. Enough of that. Nah. I don't feel like reading up on kings, countries, or history right now. Then you are lame as frick. Hmm. What's this? You pick- Holy shit, that's cool. Wait, do I have a student ID? Student ID from my school. I'm still not quite sure if studying botanics and biology is right for me and god knows mom didn't think so, doesn't think so. But I like nature and I like the idea of maybe one day fixing the planet and winning the Nobel Prize or something. Or setting up a flower shop. You know, whichever. Also not the be best picture of me, but yeah, it's me. Let me see. What's your name? Sarah Elizabeth Wright student. Necklace. A necklace I got from grandpa when I turned 10. He jokes that it was magical and that it would keep me safe from monsters and such under my bed. <gasps> and I believe believed him for the longest time. I've worn it since and now that he's gone I don't think I'll ever stop wearing it. Cell phone. Um, Matson flip phone. It's a year old but it works pretty great. I'm not in a hurry to upgrade and even though the new smartphones look pretty nifty, well maybe I would if I could afford one. Okay, general page 2. It seems no coincidence that both the resting place of Pele and per Periaquaqua? I don't know what happened to be in mountains. The trek has gone well, and although the winds are ominous, my clothing and necessities have carried me well so far. The guide I hired upon arrival have proved invaluable, not only in his knowledge of the thick forest, but also for his rich knowledge and his company. Not unexpectedly, the symbol of water could be found at the peak of the summit, along with the alchemic symbol of water. Again, these symbols seem interconnected, and while one set are alchemic, alchemic symbols known to many people, the other seem strange and of no cultural design that at least I am knowledgeable of. The encounter on Hawaii makes me certain that the other two elements must bear significance as well. What will I find on this mountain? Who heckin' knows? Uh, yep. It's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa yes. sure did like his books. A tape recorder. Hello. This is Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can 
Sort off immediately, please. Sort off. <clears throat> Sarah, if you are listening to this, then it means... Well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grandmothers. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I, I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother but there were good reasons. There are things in this world greater than ourselves, and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it, it's unavoidable. Pixie, I need your help. But I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. In every breath of wind and every dancing flame. All you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. Oh, oh my grandpa. Oh, grandpa. This game, I think, is a lot more than I thought it was gonna be. Sorry, I'm a little chilly. Hey, Mr. Piggles. Oh my god, I want it. Oh man. My old A station. I spent hours playing games on this thing. Damn. The adapter's missing. Damn. Probably for the best. I wouldn't get anything done today if I started playing. It made a sound! It's a landscape painting of Whittington. I am not taking this with me right now. Weak. I am not taking this with Weak. me right now. My grandfather's grandfather clock. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck give her? There is no way I can pick this up. Ah, oh, come on. Use Grandpa your legs. loved this thing. Told me it was one of a kind. Although... He never actually told me why. It's locked. Ah, son of a bitch. Okay. Give me something to- A uh, typewriter. Berries. By Brian Froud and Alan Lee. It's a chessboard. With the game already in progress, there's no one to play. And I'm not sure I even know the proper rules. I can crouch! Whoa. This looks like it belongs in a museum. Nuh-uh. I've watched too many movies to go about stealing ancient relics. I mean, have you watched Indiana Jones? He gets away. Harrison Ford always gets away, man. It looks like a torn out page. Gimme. Q. First page. I finally landed- Take two. I finally landed on Hawaii and will soon begin my arduous climb of Mauna Lao? I'm not much of a climber, but I feel the determination. I will, however, first take some days to recuperate from the very tiresome travel, from which my fear of flights did not exactly improve. Not only was the pilot rude and dismissive of safety protocol, he also seemed completely unsure at times of what he was doing. That's when you grab a parachute and you jump. Regardless, I'm here, and will spend the coming days in the village of Pala. Whatever secrets Pele got us a fire holds, it is now within my grasp. Oh, that makes sense. I've definitely reached the right place, although I'm wary from travel, I'm too excited to sleep. The villagers are friendly, but warn me of hurting customs, something I have no intent to do. I've also noticed the alchemic symbol of fire etched over the people's doorways. Connects to Pele, of course, but is linked to the crest I've sought as well. Oh, I have my cassette date. Oh, it's just what Howard said. Okay. Yo, I got a key somewhere, man. Can I? An old bicycle. Can I have it? Hiking by train, I'm leaving by train. Weak. Does this globe have anything to do with Grandpa's message? Shoe, Egypt. And a symbol of a... swirl? 
Oh, okay. These can be pushed. What should the message say again? The world is full of secrets. Few sang China and a symbol of a tree. Okay, that's the tallest tree to the deepest river. Uh, 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 Paria Pariacaca, South America. In every breath of wind and every dancing flame. Uh, yes, Pele, Hawaii, and the fires. Ah, uh, shoot, I'm a bitch. What was it again? Is that supposed to be wind? No, that's not it. Which one are they? It was... That doesn't seem Which to one did it. I press? What did the message say again? I don't fucking know. Okay, we're going Fushane. Does this globe have anything to do with Grandpa's message? What was it again? It was... Go back. There we go. Yeah! <laughs> I did it! That was so frustrating. This looks like... Is this a second part of my necklace? Is it? Oh my god. Whoa! Holy shit! What? 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 Bruh. Press V. Whoa. Serious whoa. Yo, yo, trippy AF, bruh. Achievement unlocked back together. Hey. Come to think of it, I don't even know where he got it from. On one of his travels, I guess. It needs a key to open. Are we... I can't believe Mom wants to sell this. Hang on. I get that he missed a lot of her childhood, but come on. That's so weird. Okay, we're gonna go over here. I need to... Wait, is there anything? I should be... Okay, that... That's glowing over there. Hang on. We gotta get the fuck out of my way. There's something glowing. What are you? It's a small, simple key. Maybe it fits the desk. What do you mean it fits the desk? Nah, bruh. Hmm. Damn it. The key I have doesn't fit here. What desk? I mean, I know this is the desk, but was there something... A desk drawer. Cool. Nothing of interest, apparently. Hold on. I've worked for it, it's here, I know it. The necklace in the temple in China made all the difference. And now I'm finally in Africa, hoping to set the burning sensation of curiosity to peace. The symbols line up and my calculations were correct. The anonymous mail I received helped a gr on a grand scale, but I still have not managed to figure out the sender. Regardless, the last piece of knowledge should be here, in Egypt. And after having evaded my guide, I have now found the symbols. It's time. Time to learn- uh, I burped. Time to learn what is behind these strange connections and events. I have a photograph. An old photograph found in Grandpa's desk. It says, Sultan Hassan Mosque Madrasa, Egypt, 1966. Must have been from one of his trips. Ooh, pretty. Okay. Uh... Nothing. Hi. I gotta crouch here. Nothing. Uh, nothing. Uh, ooh. Wait, what are oh. you? It's locked. To look closer, press Z. Oh, hello. Is it. Is it Sarah? Is it gonna be Sarah? Ten bucks says it's Sarah. Damn, I was sure that would be it. Maybe I need something else to solve this. Probably. Hey, what up? Okay, nothing here. Another journal. Uh. Uh, the alchemic symbol of Earth is combined with the Chinese one for tree. While a trip has yet 
again gone well, and my research has once again led me to these symbols, I can draw no conclusion. I spent most of my life researching these mythological connections, and yet again I reached my destination, and nothing, almost as if this is all an extreme elaborate prank. I sometimes wonder if my daughter is right, months, nay years of planning, only to eventually find a temple or shrine with another symbol, another riddle, and another clue. However, at the same time, I feel like I am so, so close to finding something. Elfston. Also sometimes known as troll stones, subject of Scandinavian folklore, normal rocks with holes in them the size of an acorn were considered lucky, otherworldly, and useful. Hung from the necks of livestock, it would protect them and their farmers alike from malicious predators, trolls, and even incubi. incubi. Some tales, the owner of a true elf sin is also able to see the otherwise invisible common troll through the hole of the rock. Great, trolls exist. Oh, that's what I have. While several of these were on display, only one of them looked to be the one I was looking for, carved in a way that no average jeweler could and with ore in place of where a hole should be. I didn't acquire it through the most honest of means, but no one came to harm, and I'm sure its disappearance won't be noticed. I do wonder how it fits in all this, though. I must study it thoroughly. Okay, and on that note, I am... What thing am I supposed to unlock, by the way? Do I? Yes. With... Whoa. Serious one. Uh, hey. This must be. From, I'm only here to pick up my stuff, but maybe I'll grab this later. What button am I looking at? Yeah, like nice. Uh, yeah, we are back at it again. What do I have for inventory? Small key. What thing? A desk drawer. A desk drawer. Uh, it said to open the desk or to use on the desk, but there's nothing here to use? Like, all the drawers open perfectly fine. See, all the drawers open fine. So I don't know what's locked. Other than this. I know that's locked. Like, that- I, I'm very aware that's locked. But, uh... There's something that's locked, and it won't fit. Hmm. The key I have doesn't fit here. Yeah, it doesn't fit there, which is frustrating as it is. I can't do anything with that anymore. Yeah. Yeah, no. Enough of that. An open desk drawer. That's a really nice. Why not? This will be part. No. An open desk drawer. An open desk drawer. Yep. An open desk drawer. Yep. Huh. This tin box looks fairly old and has a combination lock on it. What could the combination be? I thought it was Sarah, but it wasn't, apparently. A-F... What is the combination lock? I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. There's not a drawer. There's nothing locked on this. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. Lovely conclusion. Hey. Aw, it's a picture of us. Grandpa, you sweet old bastard. Am I just dumb? Hey. Show me shit. Because I see that. Hey, look at the outside. Very, very vast. Where does this key... A desk drawer. Go. An open desk drawer. Fascinating, love. What does it say? A small key looks small enough to fit in the desk, maybe. Where, though? In the desk. Uh, 
It's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. Is this indicating anything? <laughs> Does this mean anything? Oh! I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. I should see if I can find the missing pages before Does this light do anything? Celtic myths and legends. Did the light... Can I... It's a magnifying glass. For... Magnifying things. Why is it reflecting off of you? <laughs> Did I do that? Sorry. A desk drawer. A desk drawer. Am I gonna have to go through all these while she says this? A desk, a desk, a desk, a desk, a desk drawer, a desk drawer, a desk, a desk drawer, a desk, a desk drawer. Come on. A desk drawer. There we go. A desk drawer. Yeah, okay, and I have a key. Can... Pele, goddess of fire. Why was Grandpa researching Hawaiian myths? I don't know, but w is there anything in the journal? That will give me hints as to what the fuck this is. It's not Elfston. Oh, Grandma's cello. Oh, Grandma's cello. Cool. So this is where it ended up. Oh, God damn. I'm just gonna crouch and move around. Can I turn this on? Yes. Can this light be any? I'm by train. I'm leaving by train. Sorry, wrong button. A lot of buttons I keep fucking up here. Uh... It's an old table lamp. These books are all so old. Nah, I don't feel like reading up on kings, countries, or history right now. We got... It's a lamp for the typewriter. Thanks. I say annoyed as I... I'm literally at this point looking for any light sources because the sun is going down and I'm getting frustrated. A uh, typewriter. Cool. My grandfather, there is no way I can pick this up. I'm not expecting you to. Hmm. Can I turn the other oh this light's already on well shit where what desk okay so I realized there's one word I didn't try a desk drawer shut up that associates with this there's an X, which means... Okay, Grandpa, I need a clue to unlock this box. So if you're here... Huh. Guess I'll have to work it out myself. It's locked. Shit. There. Holy shit nuggets. Whoa. Fancy key. Ah. Now you're going off? Okay, so there's Pixie. Oh. Aha. Okay, so... Weren't these triangles in the journal pages? Shit. Weren't they? Okay, open... Open triangle, 
flame. Shit, which side? Okay, pointing up. So this has to go... It's stuck in place. I probably need to select a clock hand somehow. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, fine. That one is first. That's you. Okay, you are the tree. Wait, no, are you? Downward. Yes, so you are tree. Where is tree? Tree is down there. Okay. It won't budge. It will budge. Okay. Uh, what can I... Is that wrong? Did I do that wrong? <laughs> Shit, I did that wrong. Okay. How close am I? Okay. It won't budge. It won't budge. It won't budge. It weighs like 200 pounds. I am aware. Okay. Oh, I see. It's stuck in place. What do you mean? This hand is a triangle. It won't bug. It won't. I probably need to select a clock hand somehow. How? This clock hand is a triangle. It won't budge. We're just gonna do this. button seems to select clock hands. Figured it the fuck out. Hang on. This clock hand is a triangle facing inwards with a line through it. See, I literally had to just fucking get close to it because I'm an idiot. Okay. This button seems Bam. to control what clock hand can be moved. Okay, which one is this one? Fire. Which one was fire? It won't budge. You know that's a goddamn lie. Damn it. Sorry. Okay. Downwards triangle. Which means... Tree? Okay, so I need to set these hands correctly. Maybe the answer is in Grandpa's journal pages. Assumingly, I did not do that correctly. Uh, which means... We're gonna do a little switcheroo. Was that it? There we go. Did I do it? I appreciate the flannel shirt Sarah has on, by the way. Also, what the fuck just happened? That was the first time I traveled by magic. Pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries. I so wish he told me sooner. So we could have gone on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure. The one that never was. Saying the name of the game. That is a longer story. For another time. She went unlocked what never was.
Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? 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 Hold on, hold on. Does it just restart? If I hit new game? Hey, Mom. Where are you? I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. Oh my god, it just restarts. Alright. Let's do this. Okay. That was a lot. That was a cliffhanger and a half. What the fuck? Okay, then. Uh... I, 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 uh, I, uh, I guess that's it. Um, yeah. I, I wasn't expecting that to end so quickly. <laughs> um, yeah, so that was what never was. Uh, I would have loved to go on that adventure. But I guess we're not going to. Which is fine. Just threw me for a loop. Uh, yeah, so, so, that, that's that. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you liked this video, hit like. If you would like to see more, hit subscribe. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next video, whatever I make. Uh, yeah. Stay awesome, guys. Love you. Bye.